welcome to another episode of PSRE Science Made Simple. I'm Vanessa, and I'm a PSRE Science Specialist here at the Pink Lab. In this video, I'll be analyzing a past year examination question on the topic of animal cycles. I've also prepared this question for you to download for free by clicking a link in the description box below. So let's get started. Question 4. Jeremy compared the life cycle of the butterfly and the grasshopper. This question is asking which of the following comparisons are correct. Let's look at characteristic A. Does the butterfly and the grasshopper have four stages in its life cycle? How many stages does the butterfly have in its life cycle? Four. How about the grasshopper? How many stages does the grasshopper have in its life cycle? Three. Hence, is it true that the butterfly has four stages in its life cycle and the grasshopper does not have four stages in its life cycle? Yes, so this comparison is true for both organisms. Let's take a look at the next characteristic. Does the young of the butterfly and the grasshopper moult? Let's recall which group of organisms undergo moulting. Insects. Why do insects undergo moulting? This is so that the young of the insect can shed their hard outer covering to grow bigger. Since both the butterfly and grasshoppers are insects, should they undergo molting? Yes. Hence, is comparison B correct? No. This is so as the grasshopper should undergo molting as well. The next characteristic is comparing if the young of the organism resemble its adult. We mentioned that the butterfly has a four-stage life cycle. Let's recall, for all organisms that have four stages in its life cycle, does the young resemble its adult? No, we know that the larva and the pupa does not resemble the adult. Hence, as long as the organism has a four-stage life cycle, the young would not resemble its adult. What about the grasshopper? Does the young of the grasshopper, which is the neem, resemble its adult? Yes. For insects that have three stages in its life cycle, such as the grasshopper, the young would resemble its adult. Hence, is this comparison true for both the butterfly and the grasshopper? Yes. Lastly, let's look at characteristic D. Do the organisms lay its eggs in water? Do butterfly lay their eggs in water? No, they lay their eggs on land. Let's also recall where do grasshopper lay its eggs. Grasshopper lay their eggs on land as well. Hence, this comparison is incorrect for both the butterfly and the grasshopper. With this, the correct comparisons are A and C, and the correct answer should be 1. Thank you for watching and I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to check out more videos by us, do click on the links on the right hand side. Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you next time. Bye!